Will you press the subscribe button? Hello everyone, and welcome to Will You Press The Button. If you guys remember, when I played Would You Rather, I said I will most likely do this, and well, yeah, I'm doing it now. Basically, Will You Press The Button, it's like Would You Rather, but it's different, so what it is is, well, literally, will you press the button on something, basically, it, it says, you get this thing, but if you get that, then like there's a downside to it and you gotta live with that so basically i'm gonna start off and show you guys what i mean all right so the first one is will you press the button you become a hero who saves the world by collecting various tools but when you save the world you get rid of your tools and wake up in another world to do it all over again all right so these ones you have to think more than would you rather because would you rather it's like yeah I'll just take this one and this but will you press the button it's like oh i really want it but oh, i have to live with this so it's like, this game gets you to think much more. Alright, so, I think I will because if I do it all over again, it doesn't say for a second time I have to wake up in another world again and do it for like a third time. So I will press the button. Up, oh, okay, and only 49% of the people agree with me. Alright, next one. A new universe is created where you become its god. Oh, that'd be so cool. But you have to live for the eons it will take for the universe to end before the next one is made including after earth is gone and you're just floating in space well if you're god then you can if you're god of an entire universe you can basically do anything you can create your own world and and live on that like a normal person but with powers so i would because i could just do whatever all right next all right so you live in a false reality and you live an extremely happy life if you push the button and you will see true reality cool but you will never see the old reality and it will halve your lifespan oh jesus so much to think I i'm just gonna say no i don't i don't want to like think insanely much about this all right so everything in life is free everything but you will see no value or purpose or anything Best comment. Of course it has no value. It's all free. <laughs> I love the comment section in these kind of websites. I'm gonna say I will not. And one thing I forgot to mention, guys, is this website is literally willyoupressthebutton.com. So if you type that in, then you're gonna be on the site. You gain godlike powers and people start to worship you and even start a religion after you. But you can still die and all the other religions accuse you of blasphemy and try to execute you and your followers. Okay, so blasphemy basically means where people think you, you talk bad about God, which I do not. So basically all the religions will think that you're against God, then try to kill me and my followers. Well, no, because then innocent people would die, and all they're trying to do is start a religion after me. Alright, so, next one. You will acquire all the power slash abilities of the superhero I choose. I wonder what superhero that be. But here, I'm just gonna read the next thing. But, you also butt everyone. Okay, it obviously means put everyone you love and care for at severe danger and risk of death. I'm not gonna do that. You will be beautiful and funny, but no one can see or hear your presence. <laughs> what that what would be the use of either of those? No. You know all the languages in the world, but not the language of your country. Well, no. I mean, I, <laughs> I think English is more important than knowing every other language because English is one of the main Englishes. Yep. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. You have everything but you don't want. Is it trying to say you have everything you don't want? Well, I'm still gonna say yes because then I could just sell all that stuff and become rich. Alright, you can read minds. So, uh, what's that called? Uh, telepathy? Telepathic, I think that's called? I might be right. But, you are always stepping on Legos wherever you go barefoot. No! Alright, you can teleport anywhere on Earth, but you will be recognized as a criminal in every place you teleport. What if I teleport to the North Pole? Would there be anyone there to make, call me a criminal? I'm gonna say no. You have- you can have the power of God and do whatever you want with it. Oh, sweet. But, you can't use it to help yourself in any way possible. And you can't keep someone from dying. And you can't kill any person that has sinned. So basically, you can have God's powers, but you can't use it to help 
myself in any way possible. You can't keep someone from dying, well then, then you don't have all of God's powers. Okay, so any person that's sinned, that basically anyone who's a criminal. Well, I mean, yes, because you can still help people in some ways. Like, if someone, like, let's say, uh, slip, then you could just be like, oh, no, no, you're not gonna slip. That you could just bring them back up. So, you would, so it's either you just have them or not. Even if you can't use it on yourself. Alright, so, become your baby self, but with your present memories intact, okay? But you'll never meet my best friend. Oh, no. I mean, assuming I only have one, I have more than one best friend. Jeez. <laughs> oh my god, my eyes became so big there. You get unlimited free video games, but your consoles crumble to dust the second you touch it. Okay, so what if I just like put like one of those like a uh, really thin gloves on so I could so my gloves would be touching them, not my hands. So yeah, because I could just wear gloves. I would have to put up a sign that says wear gloves though. You can reap anyone's mind, okay, but you can only hear negative thoughts. Alright, another one of those uh, telepathic things. Alright, so I would still though, because then I would hear anyone who like is thinking about me. I could just give them a look, like seriously, because it's like it's still reading people's minds, and you still get to choose when to use it and who do you want to use it. You are the chosen one with any powers you deserve, and you can do whatever you wish with absolutely no consequences whatsoever. But whichever power you choose will slowly affect your mental and later physical state negatively. Let's see, uh, what if my chosen power was for my mental and later physical state to not get affected negatively for anything whatsoever? What if that's my power? <laughs> Loophole. <laughs> but I'm gonna say no. Alright, find out the meaning of life, all questions you have answered, everything and anything you want to know. But can't tell anyone about what you have discovered ever. That would make normal conversations hard because, like, you'll see, like, um, if they ask you a question about something, you'll be, you'll be like, mm, mm, I can't tell you that. If Even if someone's just asking you, like, what are pencils made of? You're like, I can't tell you that. I literally can't tell you that. I'm telling you that. But still, I'm gonna go with this. I'm gonna say yes because I still know everything. I just realized. It's a good thing I pressed it because it says tell, which means, like, say it out loud. Not, it doesn't say... You, I can't write it down. Oh, genius. All right, you can make any meal masterfully, but you can never eat it. Sure, because I could be like a chef. I could be like a really good chef and I could make lots of money. I wouldn't mind always having other people make my meals. I wouldn't mind that. So I get 10,000 euro slash dollars, etc. All right, so $10,000 a month, but a stranger you don't know dies every time you take the money. No. Okay, only 62% of people agree with me. You get the ability to travel in time, but you can only travel in one direction, future or past, which you choose before gaining the ability. So basically, what it's saying is you could never go back to the present. And I wonder if I do that, well, like, if I, like, say, go into the future, would I age too doing it? Or would I just be in, like, my current state? I don't know. If I had to choose, I'm gonna say... Yes, and I would choose the future because then I could travel so far into the future that they'll they'll have a time machine that goes back in time. Genius. <laughs> you will gain the ability to fly, so like be Superman, but there's a 5% chance that your ability will stop working mid-flight. Well, in that case, I'll bring a jetpack along in case that happens. Oh, and someone said just always wear a parachute. Well, yeah, I guess I could do that too. So yes, then. So I could wear a jetpack or a parachute. You will be reincarnated multiple times, but each life you live is short and you will be brutally killed. No. You'll get superpowers, but but so does everyone else. Well, this guy commented, I want the superpower to shut off other people's powers within a certain radius just for the sake of trolling. Well, in that case, I'm going to say yes. Okay, here's a long one. You receive a device that lets you transfer and replace someone else's thoughts with your own, much like files on a computer and have the effects become immediately evident. Oh, <laughs> so you could basically like change someone's life by doing that, okay. But the device runs on a radioactive battery. For every memory or thought you transfer, the emitted radiation lowers your lifespan by six months. No, I do not want to die half a year earlier every time I use that. You can control 
the life or death of anyone except yourself? Well, sure then, because this is one of those questions that say, well, you can either have it or you don't. If you don't have it, then oh well, you don't have it. So yeah, I can make like people live longer, which would be so cool. You can go back in time and return. Oh, and return. Sweet. That's that's exactly what you need. But anything you do will change the future, not just your, and not necessarily in a good way. Well, no then. Yeah, I don't know why I wasn't thinking of that in the first place. You gain eternal happiness, but everyone you love is in suffering, and all you can do is, <laughs> all you can do is spend. This is the wor this is probably the worst one I've seen on this entire website. Anyone who presses that button is pure evil. You can travel the world for two straight years. All expenses paid. Oh, that'd be so cool. But you have to spend the rest of your life in the same small town. All right, so for the next two years, I can basically travel anywhere for free. But I to spend the rest of my life living here. Well, I mean, I don't I don't hate this house or the town I'm in. I'm not necessarily in a town. I'm kind of in the country, so you're you're assuming I'm in a town, which is offensive. But since I don't live in a town, then that effect doesn't apply to me, so I'm gonna press the button. Because I don't live in a town, I live in the country. Plus, even if I did live in a town, there's nothing wrong with it. Alright, so guys, this is gonna be the last question. Oh my gosh, this is the perfect one to end it off in. Alright, pressing this button is forbidden. Nothing will happen, and no one will know if you do press it. Well, guys, you guys gotta decide with me. Will you press the button even though it's forbidden and nothing will happen and no one will know if you press it? What do you guys think? I think I'm gonna press it. 82% <laughs> of the people did it. This is perfect. Alright guys, so that's gonna be the end of the video. Thank you all so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Have an amazing rest of your day.